there we go. Uh, I've already eaten the last dragon pie. Grab that, grab the stones, which have gone cold now, which is a bit of a shame. Oops. Never mind. We can always put in another fire. So, uh, I'm not going to bother mining any stone. I am going to grab any grass that I see as we wander around finishing exploring this area off. But I've kind of got the suspicion that this is just going to be like an empty wilderness. <laughs> it kind of does look like it, doesn't it? But you got to do it. you got to do it because you could, you could come across a touchstone anywhere. So... I could get a lot of bones and stuff, but but nah. Oh, we've got a nice, got a nice road to speed things up. A little bit. Um, uh, I am hungry, and I haven't got any food at all. Uh, there's some grass over here we can grab. Uh, now hang on, I had a meat, didn't I? Did I? Have, yeah, you know what? Some, what have I got in? Chester. I had a meat from the Pengals. Where the hell's that gone? No idea. No idea. Grab that grass. Um, yeah, I think we're going to be... Um, I think we might just be heading home at this point. Unless I can actually find some food. So... Yeah, let's have a look at the map. So we've, uh, we've got all of that. Now, obviously, I, I mean, I, I could go and do some fishing, for example. <clears throat> Um, I could see if there's anything in the bird traps. That's a point. We've got pengals over there. Uh, could maybe nick a few eggs. <clears throat> um, and I could always cook up some of the meat that I've got, some of the um, monster meat, and eat that. But then that's not going to be good for my sanity, so that's probably not an option at this point. Damn, I was hoping to spend a bit of time over here. Uh, I tell you what, yeah, I wonder. We could get the pigs. Ooh, we could recruit the pigs and get them to attack the pengals or something like that. That's an interesting idea. Ooh, let's go and do that, shall we? We're going to have to do it quickly, though, because literally I am... If I'm not careful, I'm going to freaking starve. Ouch. But we've got cactus flesh. Ouch. I should like put my armor on or something. But we've got three of those. We can cook those up and uh, and eat that. So where's our camp? Our camp is here. Let's throw. Uh, uh, let's put those together. Great bit of space. Let's throw that on there. Let's cook these up. There we go. Now it's not massive, but it'll just keep us going. Hopefully long enough. Now, let's have, uh, let's have a look into so Let's get the monster meat. Now, uh, the, pigs will be, the pigs have gone to bed now. Oh, god damn. So, my timing, like, really sucks. Now, I am going to grab that green mushroom. That's for damn sure. Because that will solve my sanity problems. And, silk, you know what? Uh, Chester, where are you? Let's put the ashes away in you. I saw some more silk. So, let's grab the green mushroom, grab the silk. If we can find any more green mushrooms around, that would... I mean, my sanity's already not too bad. But... If I get my sanity up a bit more, like that, then I've got the option of just cooking off a monster meat and uh, and eating that which solves my uh, solves my problem how much grass have i got up to 7 i would need 9 in order to get uh, another bedroll oh but there's a grass uh, there's a, another rope haha <laughs> so that would actually solve the problem there's another grass there we'll grab that now if I could be sneaky and push the pengals out of the way before they grab their eggs, I can grab their eggs. Uh, get away. Get away from that egg. That egg's mine. Uh, combine the stack. Pick them up. Ah, got a couple of eggs. That was a sneaky little 
egg grab. So, you know, I'm going to use one of the freaking saplings. <laughs> there we go. That's a roaring fire. Let's cook up a couple of eggs. Combine the stack. Pick them up. Eat and eat. Yeah, we're getting we're getting by. We're surviving. And let's face it, that's what's important. Let's drop that down there. That can heat up. Drop that down there. Oh, they're getting nice and hot now. That's more like it. All right, cool. Um, that blow dot, that can go into Chester. And uh, anything else that could go into Chester? Yeah, kind of. Well, that nighter could go into Chester, I suppose. There we go. It's going to stand by the fire. Uh, the, yeah, but I don't know, maybe the silk or the saplings. I could put the saplings away. Although, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to use those. Burn them. Uh, that lantern can go up there. I could get another bedroll going if I wanted to, but I don't think... Uh, I don't know. I mean, it'd get me through the freaking night, but the problem is the hunger. So that's probably... Although, you know what? See, what I can do is I can do a trade-off. So I can cook off some monster meat, and then I could sleep and then eat the monster meat in the morning. Um, do I do that? Yeah, I think, you know, I think I do. So let's make a straw roll. Uh, now we want the fire to last. Because I want my stones to be still be warm. So I'm going to put another one of those on the fire. I'm going to use my straw roll. Now hopefully, when we wake up in the morning. Oh, okay, well, you know what? Let's use that last sapling because I want to get rid of it anyway. There we go. So we've got to fight. Well, now we do need to eat. So, boom, boom, boom. So we're basically back up to the same 60 hunger that we're at. About the same 135 sanity. So yeah, we've just passed some time, which is not necessarily a bad thing. All right. So, oh, and we've got a pig. Oh, you pig. Let's recruit you. And so pig over here. Any pigs over here? No. Oh yeah, I see a pig. I see a pig. Actually, you know what? I'm going to feed you two because it's going to go to waste anyway, and it means that you'll follow me for like each meat is like half a day, so they'll follow me for a full day now. So give you that, and then give you another one. There we go. Right, cool. Uh, right, where are we, we so we've got two guys. Now we could get them to fight the pengals, for example, and then get the meat and pigskins and stuff, if we wanted to, or we could go and fight the spiders. I don't know. I think maybe let's go and fight the pengals. Should we go and fight the pengals for a bit? It's a bit different. Let's equip this spear. So where the hell are here's the pengals? Uh, pigs. There you go, pigs. Now I'm expecting the pigs to get killed, which will give me some nice meat. Because that bunch of pengals should take care of these guys, no problem. There we go. Grab that. Oh, we got got a feather and an egg. Cool. Come on, pig. Kill another one. Oh. What happened there? And well, we got another egg and another meat. Okay, well that's not the end of the world. Okay, um, let's grab a thermal stone. Just going to go down to the McTusk camp again quickly and see if there's anything. There's uh, there was a bush hat. Oh, we'll take the bush hat with us. We got a couple of those. We've got another rope. Uh, do I want that? Yeah, probably. I don't know. Probably more than I want. I don't know. Let's go and let's go and cook up these eggs. We'll eat those, and I think we're going to head back to base, maybe, because it, there's kind of nothing else to do apart from McTusker out here. So let's. Oh, eat that. Pick up the other one. Eat that. There we go. So we're keeping going, and obviously I could cook off this meat. So that's a possible food source as well. And that's like 25, that's like 50 hunger. 
that would keep us going for a while. Uh, let's grab that thermal stone. That one can go back down there. Yeah, how much of the evening have we got left? We've still got a bit of the evening left. Should we go and have a look round? Should we go and have a bit of a, an explore? I'd really like to explore this area. It is the kind of area where you might find a touchstone. So let's go have a bit of an explore. Come on. <coughs> I'm joking. <coughs> Sorry about that. <coughs> Dear me. Ay, ay, ay. Right, so are we going to find anything in here? I think the chances are pretty slim, but it's always worth a look. And there's another pig house over here. And got more spiders down there. More spiders up here. God, there's, there's a hell of a lot of spiders in this area. That's for sure. And uh, obviously we're also in a graveyard. Oh, mole rat. Pig house. Yes, I know. Nothing down here like usual. Um, there's only really like that area. I mean, I doubt there's anything there. There's a couple of pig houses. In fact, there's a whole bunch of pig houses. I mean, I could knock these down and get like loads of materials to take back to base. But... I don't know whether that's a good idea. Probably, I don't know, probably not. Where, where was I going to look? I was going to look up there, wasn't I? Let's, let's keep going. Let's keep going. How's my thermal stone? Can you even see my... Oh, there it is. It's still warm. So we've got uh, more spiders over there. Yeah, more graveyard. More graveyard. Let's just have a look at the map. Yeah, there's... Nothing. Nothing. We've got those clockworks over there, but we don't need gears right now. Um, you know what? Chester. Come a bit closer, will you? Chester? Oh. Don't hide behind trees. Thank you. Let's put that in you. Let's put that stone in you. Hello, Pengles. Let's grab that mushroom for a bit of sanity. That's a good plan. And, oh, we've got a not a pig lying around outdoors. Let's equip bottle lantern. Um, oh, I'm supposed to be revealing this, aren't I? Yes, I am. Yeah, I don't think we're going to find. I don't think we're going to find anything particularly. I mean, we've got these um, clockworks here, so I'm thinking it's very unlikely that we've got a touchstone right next to them. I mean, it's not out of the. It's not completely impossible. The hell is that? The hell is that? I don't know. Is that just a graphical glitch or? I don't know. Don't know. So, yeah, there's nothing up at the clockworks. What the hell is that up there? Oh, it's fireflies. Just fireflies. Nothing special. Okay, well, I think we're kind of done in this area then. Let's have a look at the map again. Yeah, I mean, we're... There really isn't anything else. I mean, I can explore this tiny bit, but there's not going to be anything there. It's not big enough to hide like a touchstone. So, like, I think we're down to exploring this. The other touchstone's got to be in this area. The, I mean, we've explored the rest of the map. This is the edge of the map all the way around. So it, it must be down here. Yeah, we've definitely explored all of that. There's, it's coastline all the way around. Yeah, I, well, I think we're heading back to base. I think we're heading back to base. So let's get onto the road. Do I want that rot? Nah. <laughs> nah, leave it alone. Uh, am I on the road? Yeah, I am now. There we go. So back down to my little base. And... Oh, oh, missed you. Oh. Let's chase them off and get there we go. Yeah, got rid of both of them. Excellent. Alrighty. So I can undo that. I'd better cook these off while I've got the chance. One, two, three. Uh, I think I'm going to... Well, I can cook off that green cap as well. Alright, so that gets me a bit of sanity back. I'm going to have to eat at least one of these and probably both of them okay I tell you what rather than just sit around here I think we grab that trap 
and get the hell out of here. Let's equip uh, a bottle at them and just go. I don't, I don't see any point sitting around. There's, there's kind of nothing to do there, so. I can go up here and we can uncover this area. Which at least is something. And I can grab that grass. That's a, that is a good idea. Uh, oh, what the hell is that? Oh, it's just a bit of tumbleweed. Yeah. Don't chase tumbleweed. It's very, very unproductive. Let's have a look. Yeah, there's nothing else to explore around here. So, yeah, I mean, like, well, I suppose we go down here then. Like, while we're here, there's no point going back to base and then coming back here. Um, the issue is going to be what we eat. So, I don't know. I wonder if I wonder if there's any meat lying around with these spiders and the tall birds. It's a possibility, but yeah, I think we had a go down here. There may well be meat lying around down here. There often is, because um, if you get stuff, if you get I don't know, like a, a fisher merm would be good right now. That would be kind of bang on. That'd be exactly what we wanted. Uh, let's go and try and pick up this bit of road over here. Speed things up a little bit. Right, at least it's daytime. I can put this lantern out. There we go. Ooh, there's grass here, guys, so I'm going to grab it because we're fairly low. Although, sanity's pretty good right now, so I don't think we're going to be need to, needing to use bedrolls, like, desperately. But, good idea to grab them while they're here. All right, let's carry on heading down towards the the nasty marsh. The marsh is a very, very dangerous place, especially when you're wearing a piggyback, which slows you down. It's kind of not the best idea running around in a marsh with a piggyback. So what I might do is I might drop this and, uh, and just put my armor on and just run around in that. Probably a, probably a better idea. How's the hunger? We're at 50 hunger. Uh, we need to get across here, so we need to go straight across. Alrighty. Whew, man. Day 240. Staggering. Absolutely staggering. I mean, I could pick a few flowers to get my sanity up, but it's kind of okay at the moment. So, so I'm not going to worry too much. Uh, being around the graves... Drops your sanity though, so we need to just be aware of that. Ooh, now. Ooh, we've got guano. Let's put that in Chester. That might come in useful later. Oh, yeah, here we go. If nothing else, we could use it for fuel for a fire. Because uh, I've only got like, I've only got like seven logs left. So... Not the inexhaustible supply. I could eat another one of these monster meat. Uh, let's eat another one of those monster meat. All right. Uh, we'll grab the grass and twigs. Just to keep the stocks up. See, we're up to 16 again. 17 and this will be 18. So that's enough for like two. Oh, there's more grass around here. I'm going to grab. I am going to grab this. It's too valuable. So we had enough for two grass rolls or straw rolls. And uh, now we're working on working on having enough for num number three. Now hang on, this area here I haven't explored. Which I didn't realise. Okay, well, let's, um, let's have a look at this area. I'm, I'm not going to bother picking reeds at the moment because I think it's, I think that's one thing too much. Grab that bit of flint. Grab this bit of grass. So this. So what's in this? I don't. I didn't realise I hadn't explored this. I thought this was just coastline, but apparently not. So let's go and have a look. I'm full of emptiness, and I've got no food, apart from these two monster meats. Now I could eat like one more. You know what? I'll eat one more. There we go. And you know what? I'm going to eat the. I'm going to eat the other one. 
because they'd already gone from 18.8. Oh, and now I'm too freaking cold. So let's put a fire in quick. We don't want to be losing hit points to that. Uh, let's get uh, let's get you dropped. There we go. And the other one there. Wait, oi! You oh, that's where my other one went. You little! I should have equipped this and beaten him up. Huh. Uh, I tell you what, you want to eat something? Here you go. Come and eat this. Come over here. Come and eat this rock. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Thanks very much. Ha! I really should have put Abigail down, shouldn't I? I really should. Oh well, never mind. So let's pop that one down there and. Back to what we were doing. Drop that one. Now, oh, come on. Drop that one. Oh, why won't you drop it? Thank you. And uh, Chester, give me that manure. We'll use the guano for fuel. Okay, we're almost at night time. So again, I'm going to put a couple of fuel on there. And I think we'll do the same thing. I think we'll just sleep through the night. So straw roll. Um, yeah, the problem with that is hunger. We've got one morsel for first thing. But that's kind of it. But the thing is, there's not that much I can do. Um, let's see, are there any berry bushes or stuff around? There's some berry bushes over there. Let's go, let's go and see if we can't go and grab a few berry bushes. If we can get a few berries, we can cook those off, and then that would get us back up to uh, at least a little bit of food tomorrow. Uh, so look where they are. So yeah, I'm, going, I'm headed in the right direction. Uh, yep, yeah, there we go. Berries. Oh yeah, you can grab that grass at the same time. I kind of like this whole winter survival away from base. Where you're just kind of foraging, getting a bit of food here, a bit of food there. It's kind of, it kind of feels like going back to, like when you first started the game, and you haven't got anything, and you're just living off the land. So let's grab that. So we got three berries. There's no more. Oh, there's a carrot down there. And you know what? I've got room for it, so I'm going to grab it. I'll grab these, and then I think we're going to head back to the fire. So all I've got to do now is remember where I put the blooming fire in. It was up here somewhere, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, remembering where the fire was might have been a good thing. Uh, that's fireflies over there. Where did I put it? I've no idea. Absolutely no idea. Oh, oh man. Where did I put the freaking fire? I thought it was around here somewhere. No, apparently not. It's got my blooming thermal stones. Where is it? Oh, there it is. It went out. Okay, fair enough. That ashes can go into Chester. And let's put in... Yeah, uh, hang on. Let's have a look at this location. It's like a really lousy place to put in a, a camp. But I'm wondering at this point, do we just... Uh, just pick the stuff up and head over here. Maybe, maybe put a campfire a permanent campfire in just like just up here that idea I think it kind of might be and this I why didn't I spot that I hadn't explored this I don't know I'm, I'm seriously I'm blind sometimes let's um let's grab the stones uh, yeah just keep going just keep going just eat that morsel yeah what the hell eat the morsel there we go all right We'll carry on exploring this area, because again, could be a tubstone in here, but I don't think there is. Doesn't look like it, does it? Sure as hell does not look like it. Nah, nothing of any interest. Right, let's get over here. We'll put in a permanent fireplace, I think. 
So we'll put in a permanent fire pit. I don't know, just about there would do. Cha-ching! Right, cool. Let's cook off that carrot. We'll eat that, I think. We'll cook off these berries. One, two, three. We'll put the thermal stone. Oh, just put it down for heaven's sake. And the other one. There we go. Yeah, we'll throw it. We're running out of logs. That's kind of the <laughs> the only problem. I can put that down. Right. So, you know what? There's a bit of rot over there. That can go on the fire. That'll do. You just want it a, you just want it a little bit hotter than it is now. Yeah, let's use a couple of twigs as well. There we go. Now we've got a roaring fire. So what we'll do is we'll wait a couple of seconds. We'll pick these up. And then we'll go and... Uh, and have an explore in the marsh which should be kind of interesting there's um because the, the, we, we know the marsh extends over to there so there's at least that kind of area to explore we know that there's it extends over here so there's this area to explore um there isn't anything more down here well there's a tiny bit down there but there's this central area that we need to explore and then and then that's it that's the map explored there is a tiny bit up here but I can't imagine there's a touchstone there. I mean, there could be, but... So I think if we're going to find another touchstone, it's going to be in this area. So, you know what? Oh, well, there's also there's also this area here and this area here. That's also a possibility. I'd forgotten about that. All right, guys. Come back for the next episode and see. Can we actually find something? And, um... I don't know. McTusk. All we got was a walrus tusk. Not, not staggering result, but you never know. See if we can do better next episode. Peace out.